is a mobile super chip. This little tiny thing here is a mobile super chip. 256 processor cores, CUDA processor cores, eight CPU cores, and a four by four configuration. The world's first mobile chip to be able to perform 4K video at 60 hertz with 10-bit video in both H.265 and VP9. Nothing like it in the world. The world's first mobile super chip, Tegra X1. Tegra X1 is called Tegra X1 because of Maxwell. Tegra X1. The performance is really quite amazing. We set the bar with TK1, and it's the highest performance mobile processor in the world a year ago. Even to this day, it is still holds the performance leadership relative to all mobile processors in the world. This is comparing to the Apple A8X, which just came out a year later. And when you compare that to TX1, Tegra X1, we're going to set the bar yet again. But what makes Tegra X1 really super special, and it's made possible because of the Maxwell GPU architecture, is the energy efficiency that we're able to achieve. With Tegra K1, we were already the most energy efficient architecture in the world. The state-of-the-art Unreal Engine 4 running Elemental. Guys, let's roll it. Is that amazing, guys? <laughs> now, that was not a video. That was all run in real time. You were seeing Unreal Engine 4 running Elemental, the demo done by Epic. Everything was done in high dynamic range lighting, which basically means each one of the pixels, the RGB, are all floating point. Everything was done in high dynamic range. Notice that all the particle systems, the physics simulation, when the castle collided and, and uh, rocks were falling, all of the lighting, all of the shadows, all done in real time. The lava was lighting the environment around it. All of this possible now in a little mobile super chip we call Tegra X1. Exactly the same engine that runs on a high-end PC, exactly the same engine that runs in a next-generation game console, Tegra X1. Now, Tegra X1 has also something that's quite unique that has never been introduced in one of our architectures before. Tegra X1 is the first GPU that we have that includes a new format we call FP16, 16-bit floating point. When you combine all of the processors, 256 processors inside our chip, the floating point throughput of TX1 is really unbelievable. It is the world's first mobile super chip to exceed one teraflops of computational throughput. One teraflops. Now, to put that in perspective, up until the year 2000, the fastest supercomputer in the world achieved one teraflops. Now, of course, it's 64-bit floating point instead of 16. However, 16 is what we need, and I'll explain that in just a moment. One teraflops in the year 2000 was the fastest supercomputer in the world. It required 10,000 Pentium Pros and consumed one million watts. Now, a, Teg a Tegra X1 consumes about 10 watts running full out. A Core i7 running full out consumes somewhere between 100 to 200 watts. Tegra X1, the world's first teraflops mobile processor. 